Hi students, this video, Example Problems Based on Euclid's Division Algorithm is brought to you by GreatBooster.in. Before watching this video, please watch Euclid's Division Algorithm Concept Explainer video for a better understanding. Find the HCF of 24, 38 by EDL method. Here we have to find the highest common factor of 24, 38 by using Euclid's Division Algorithm which is based on Euclid's Division Lemma. Let us begin with the division process. Now take the two numbers 24, 38 and choose the bigger number as dividend and the smaller one as divisor. Divide 38 by 24, 24 once, 24 and the remainder is 14. Now apply Euclid's division lemma. Euclid's division lemma states that A is equal to BQ plus R. Now substitute the values from the division. Identify different terms in the division. Here the dividend becomes A, that is 38 becomes A and the divisor becomes B, that is 24 becomes B and the quotient the 1 is Q and the remainder 14 is denoted by R. Now substitute these values in the Euclid's division lemma A is equal to BQ plus R. A is equal to 38, B is equal to 24 into Q is 1 plus remainder 14. Here the remainder is not equal to 0. So according to Euclid's division algorithm, we have to repeat the process till R is equal to 0. Continue the process by making R as divisor and B as dividend. 14 divides 24 one time and the remainder is 10. Now once again let us express this in the form of EDL. 24 equal to 14 into 1 plus 10. Even though the remainder is not equal to 0. So repeat the step once again. Make the B as dividend and R as divisor. 10 divides 14 one time and the remainder is 4. Let us express this in the form of EDL. 14 is equal to 10 into 1 plus 4 even though the remainder is not equal to 0. As per Euclid's division algorithm, we have to apply Euclid division lemma till remainder is 0. Now take the 4 as divisor, 10 as dividend, 4 to 8 and the remainder is 2. Now let us express in the form of EDL, 10 is equal to 4 into 2 plus 2. Even now the remainder is not equal to 0. By continuing the division, 2 divides 4 2 times, 2 to 4 and the remainder is 0. So express it in the form of EDL. Let us write it as 4 is equal to 2 into 2 plus 0. Here R equal to 0. As per Euclid's division algorithm, if remainder is equal to 0, then B is the HCF. In this case, B is 2, so 2 is the HCF. We can mark it even in the division. This 2 is the HCF. So therefore, the HCF of 24, 38 is 2, which we found by following Euclid's division algorithm. Let us see one more example. Find the HCF of 45, 26 by EDL method. Just as like in the previous example, let us begin with the division. Now here two numbers are given 45, 26. Let us take these numbers and start division. Let us consider the bigger number as dividend and the smaller one as divisor. 26 once 26 and the remainder is 19. Now apply Euclid division lemma A equal to BQ plus R. Now substitute these values. First identify the terms A, B, Q and R. Substitute the values. 45 is equal to 26 into 1 plus 19. R not equal to 0. According to Euclid's division algorithm, repeat the process again. Divide 26 by 19. Here the remainder is 7. Express in the form of EDL. 26 equal to 19 into 1 plus 7. Even here remainder is not equal to 0. Continue the process till remainder is equal to 0. Divide 19 with 7. Here the remainder is 5. Express in the form of EDL. 19 equal to 7 into 2 plus 5. Even here remainder is not equal to 0. So again divide 7 with 5. We get 2 as remainder. And this is also not equal to 0. Repeat the process till we get 0. Divide 5 with 2. We get 1 as remainder. Once again divide it. Take 1 as divisor. And take 2 as dividend. 1, 2 is 2. And here the remainder is 0. Express in the form of EDL 2 equal to 1 into 2 plus 0. So if R is equal to 0, then B is the HCF. So here 1 is the HCF of 45, 26. Therefore, HCF of 45, 26 is 1. Mm -hmm.